Austin Zero SSC here. Uh, I'm gonna try to have a QSO with WB WB Zero LCW. Um, apparently he's got a, a mic or something that he wants to test out. There he is. WB Zero LCW calling. WB Zero LCW, this is in Zero SSC. Uh, you have definitely beat the noise. You're about a 40 over uh, here into Rolla. How do you copy? I got a good copy on you. You're about uh, 10, 15 over into uh, Independence, so uh, uh, no CQ at all here. Uh, what I want to try out, I've got a new uh, Heil PR20 mic. Uh, what's it sound like? Uh, well, you can find out. I'm actually recording this, so I'm, I might put this on YouTube sometime tonight. Um, uh, it sounds great. Cool. Yeah, I went ahead and got the, uh, the PR20, the riser, and boom, and a foot switch to work with it so I can uh, keep my hands free for contact. So, it looks like, hello, how about 1,000 watts up? Roger, roger. Uh, QSL, uh, yeah. 1,000 watts is definitely going to push that signal. I have a amplifier right next to me, but I never use it. Uh, I'm using a TS850S. Um, throw a PAL star uh, antenna tuner, and it's showing about 100 watts uh, on peaks. And the antenna on the roof is a, basically a 160 meter alpha delta uh, dipole that'll just tune up for everything. So, yeah, sounds great. Uh, how do I sound? Uh, go ahead. Yeah, sounds like you got a break, a fix and break it in there. Uh, this is uh, WB Zero LCW You're talking to N Zero FSC, or, or actually, you may be your W Zero Triple E right now. Uh, hold on a second, uh, station break. Let me let me do something thrilling. Back on. We're really trying to listen to a station you wanted to break in. It sounded like KI Four, but I can't copy. I'm gonna try a noise filter. And a lot of things we can do. So the noise filter doesn't work all the best. Turn it down. Here's AIP, Advanced Intercept Point. Uh, increase readability just a little. Coming in just over the noise, about F7, F8. Uh, my noise is only jumping up maybe F5 to F7, so not too bad on here. Uh, right now I'm on a, uh, a little uh, inverted V, I guess you call it a fan. Uh, I made it with uh, 450 ohm twin leads. Turn it down, I don't know. I have, I've not quite figured out exactly where I need to talk into this mic yet, so hopefully it's still getting through here. Uh, uh, how's that sound to you, Billing? Did you hear uh, John okay? Uh, negative. My noise floor is about S9, so I did hear, uh, I think I heard the number 4, uh, and uh, that was about it. <laughs> yeah, Roger. Yeah, that's John KR4RO from, uh, from Twitter. Uh, yeah, uh, KR4RO. Uh, usually I hear him pretty good, but he is, like say, the 40 meters is a pretty long haul. Been having good luck with this antenna. It, it has good uh, east-west uh, receive. Uh, Wanting one of these days to uh, put up something, some sort of a loop or something to try to cut the noise back a little bit. Uh, but yeah, actually, I'm not sure. Hang on a sec. I think if I turn that up, that actually I can go a little. Well, I don't know. I, I might not be completely, uh, completely wrong. Right. Before I was about a thousand, now I'm up maybe eight something. I'm not sure what I did. Oh, I know what I did. Hang on. So it's probably a little bit uh, better. <laughs> yeah, QSL, it, uh, it is a little bit better. Uh, how's this? Uh, I just turned on the amp and I'm pushing about 500 watts. QSL, how's this? Uh, well, it that push up about uh, 25, 30 over 9, but uh, cool. uh, really, you know, uh, you were pretty good before. Um, I, I don't know, you know, they say it really is a matter of uh, the first five, six, seven hundred watts is the, is the big jump. And then after that, it's, uh, it's really just maybe three decibels difference. But uh, yeah, I didn't have any problems with you, just uh, copying it before. I've got the AGC on flow, and it's like you're over here next door to me. Oh, wow, cool. Yeah, I turned it back off just uh, after you said that, so 
I was just wondering, I'm always curious about levels and stuff. Yeah, Roger. Okay, now I'll turn on the processor just for a test. So, uh, what's it sound like with the processor on? Too harsh? Ah, uh, no, it, it's definitely working as a processor. Uh, your talk power is a little bit higher, but uh, uh, it's not any more readable, I think. Here, hold on a sec. All right. Okay, this is equalizer, say, the other was with the equalizer off. This is equalizer setting one. Okay, now this is equalizer setting two. This is equalizer setting three. I found this one, I, I did some monitoring earlier, and this one sounded like it had more high. So you ready for this one? Okay, this is equalizer setting with the base two. This is probably flatter city. Okay, so this is base two through number two. Uh, let's see. Um Okay, now I'm not sure what this one is. It, it comes up as a C, so I'm not sure if that's a, uh, I don't know, I, I didn't remember listening to it before, and let's see. Okay, this is the U setting, the U setting. Okay, so now I'm back to off again. I, and I mess around with these equalizers a little bit, but I usually leave it off because I always forget and turn them on, and uh, if you're on like JP65 or something with an equalizer, it messes it Open all Open it up to 6K on 8.83 and 12k on 455 so you can hear some more of that uh, higher end uh, and, and it's not uh, blocking it out so uh, even better uh, audio uh, Put it back on flat again uh, you know I have to make experiment around with this I've actually got a little uh, um, uh, what do you call it Behringer uh, mixer here okay. that has uh, ferrite beads and uh, ferrite cores and uh, set up a little test rig with uh, that they described in QS for tuning those to figure out how many turns will block what frequency using this uh, antenna analyzer that I've got. And it seems to have worked out pretty well. Uh, however, I did have a problem at first with the antenna. In one place, it would tend to completely deafen the Wi-Fi uh, uh, router, <laughs> which is not too cool. My, my son is not cool if I completely knock wireless wireless <laughs> out. Make them all into uh, thumb, whatever you call them, thumb screws or... Uh, uh, some screws, and then I connected that all. Those are maybe mm, eight or nine, ten bucks a piece from Amazon. And that's about, about the best place I found to get them from. Uh, uh, it seems like eBay and those places don't have them unless they ship them from the UK and the shipping bills are from there. Yeah, I hear you. Well, I just sent you something over Twitter. I found this a while back. It was somebody, uh, this uh, station G3 TXQ oh, cool. has a nice analysis of these chokes. And uh, what he found was that, that the airwound ones work to a, to a certain extent, but they, they tend to be react mode stuff down. And I also found those are really good to put on, uh, like on your mic cord, right up next to the radio if you've got some extra mic cords. Quite It'll a bit. So, yeah, you're still about 30 or 40 over. And, that, yeah, that's pretty cool that uh, you come in so well. Um, I tried to have the... Q I, I put on YouTube, you might have seen, the QSO I had with W5RAW, and I think we tried it on 40 meters, and that was a mess, too. Uh, N0AX was the same when he, he lives on the other side. He lives in St. Charles. And so I'd imagine, you know, we'd have a path, but, you know, apparently not. And those are both on YouTube, and sooner or later, you'll be the next. <laughs> Uh, and uh, you'll definitely get an idea of what your uh, microphone sounds like and uh, to me it sounds great right now sounds like a uh, perfect rag chew quality Roger Roger well thanks uh, thanks like say for checking in here works pretty good with the, with the boom I, it gives me a chance to, uh, my cat really likes it because he can sit in my lap and uh, I can pet him while I'm talking on the radio and uh, so he's a hundred percent for it uh, uh, two thumbs and two do claws up so uh, Anyway, well, thanks for uh, thanks for popping in here, Sterling, and uh, I'll let you get back to all of that schoolwork and everything. Yep, yep, right? <laughs> for real. Talk to you later, uh, W Zero Triple E Seventy Three from Whiskey Bravo Zero, Lima Charlie Whiskey. All right, uh, P W B Zero L C W Whiskey Zero Triple E, or I guess November Zero Sugar Sugar Charlie at Whiskey Zero Triple E in Rolla, Missouri. They're at 73, uh, Pete, and thanks a lot for the QSO. Uh, hopefully we can uh, try again sometime. Otherwise, uh, keep posted on Twitter. 73, Pete, uh, N0 SSC, W0 Tripoli at uh, Rolla, Missouri with WB0 LCW. All right, 73. That was a really good QSO. I was really surprised about how well you came in on uh, 40 meters like that. Um, maybe next time we can try 80 or uh, any other, some other band next time. I uh, hope you got a really good idea how your PR20 sounds and uh, hope you liked how uh, we sounded here down at W0 Triple E. 73 Pete and everybody else who watched the video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, 
and watch my other videos wherever they are on the screen. Uh, they're the best videos on YouTube, I guarantee it. 73 from N0SSC at W0EEE.